You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop, and it's time for three Little Debbie products. And I really like Little Debbie products because they really make thematic type items. See, it's not just a straight brownie or just a straight bat brownie or look at their pumpkin delights. It's actually a face that looks like a pumpkin. And these have pumpkins and they're shaped a little bit differently than a, just a brownie. And the bats are actually cut out. So for me, it's always cool to check these out. And we've done some for, ooh, St. Patrick's Day and probably Easter. I can remember a few things way back. Christmas. So uh, it's time to check out these three for our fall Halloween series. Not sure if you've seen them on the shelves. But we put them all in one video this year. Sometimes we do these individually. But thought, why not just show them all at one time so we can get a good idea and do some comparisons. So when I come back, I think I'm going to save this one for last. I think I want to do the bat brownies first, the brownie pumpkins, and then the pumpkin deluxe. So let's get going on those. All right, so it's time for bat brownies. So let's check out the box a little bit. You see bats coming around here, fall leaves, brownies in the shape of bats, even with little designs on their wings. It says product enlarged to show details, so you know that. And let's flip this around. It says bat facts brought to you by the safari park the San Diego Zoo Safari Park. Blind as a bat, not so. All bats can see, and fruit bats have better eyesight than humans. Bats are the only mammals that can fly. One out of every five mammals in the world is a bat. While bats hang upside down, their feet are relaxed. They must exert energy to let go. Hmm, interesting. Didn't know, didn't know that, actually. So that's the box. Now, let's see. There's a little thumb tab here. That helps me start the process. And I think I'm gonna cut this along here with my little box tool that I use in many videos. And I don't wanna cut it right on my white top. Now a lot of people ask, why have we used a white top? That's all we've ever used is a white top. Well, one, it's easier to clean. Two, it shows less stuff than a dark color top. Now, there's a little speck there. There's a little bit something there I gotta clean up later, which I just noticed, but you won't see it. Now, for me, it's really easy to clean. And another reason is that, like for food, I don't know, most food bakeries, you think of white, the walls are white, a lot of times the equipment is white. It just looks good. You don't want black or red when you're making and eating food. This to me doesn't seem to, you know, work that well. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm talking too much and not checking these out. So let me get some scissors in here. I want to try not to, you know, when you pull the bag apart and then destroy them. So that's why I like white. And we've always used it because the color item shows up nice. But I will say if you do use a dark background, it's easier to light and it's easier to control the lighting because the background will suck up a lot of the lighting. There you go. So there is the bat. That is cool, and it looks moist. They have such moist brownies. So let me break a bat wing and inside there. Super tasty. I'm going to eat one. At least a piece. And if I was in school, this would be cool to get this in my lunchbox. Look at it. Well, maybe two. Okay, so taste-wise, it's good. I like it. It's a sweet brownie. And it's neat that you get the bat shape. You see, it looks very much like the box. I'm going to say they're pretty spot on there. Are you a little Debbie fan? Well, leave that in the comments because I need to move on to the next one. And I'm going to do that next. All right, so it's time for the Little Debbie Brownie Pumpkins. Now, the brownie's going to be the same, but now we have a new decoration. And this is a new product. Look, new, and I've said new too many times. Five brownies. Let's take a look if there's a little story back here. Unwrap a smile on the go. Find us in your favorite convenience store. Ooh, that looks so good, that picture. The coffee, the donuts, the Coca-Cola here, the honey buns. All right. Enough of that. What I did last time is I just took my cutter and kind of cut 
cut down here to make it so I can open it easier. Ooh, there we go. All right. Last time I took too many out, so I'm only going to take three out. And it's not that I want to eat all this in the video. It's just, you know, I got to check it out. Pretty good. I'm going to tell you, I like the quality of the indentation for the eyes and the face. What do you think? And it's nice. I can just stand it right there and show you. Ooh, it looks better in the light that way, doesn't it? Let me do a little lighting adjustment. All right. There you go. I hate to open another one. I need to save these. So that's what they look like. Ooh, and look. This has got a different mouth. Now the box does show three different ones. Hmm, they're tricking me here. Now I gotta take them all out and see. So this one is very much like that one. And then there is the third, see? So you get three different kinds. So those are the three different kinds. This guy's got square teeth. He's got a lot more extra little round parts in there. And then he's just got three teeth on the top. All right. Let's see if we could taste the frosting in any way. You see the layers there? I'll break it for you. I'll crack my pumpkin open and I will eat it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Tastes just like the bat one. Good. So overall, still very happy. But, I do have one more, the Pumpkin Delights. So, so far, what do you think you'd rather have, the bats or the pumpkin? So, let's move on to the next one. All right, last but not least is Pumpkin Delights. Now, a lot of times, uh, you know, here's a question for you. Well, here's an answer for you. So, I started this video. Between each video, I probably take about a minute. I put the one away, check to make sure everything's clean, and come right back and start it. So there isn't much time in this particular type of video where I take breaks or anything. I just kind of move right along. Just in case you were wondering. Let's see the back on this one. I like this. Ooh, there's a story. Let's read the story. From our family to yours. At McKee Foods, our recipe for success has always been to provide the best quality products at a good value. My grandfather began his tradition over 60 years ago, and our family has remained true to his vision. Recently, more imitation products have turned up on grocery shelves. We hope you do not confuse them with our products. When you see my picture on a box of snack cakes, you can be sure that our family's pride and attrition have gone into baking. We appreciate your business and hope that you enjoy this product. Sincerely, Debbie McKee Fowler. What does it say there? It says, Little Debbie serving Swiss rolls as her mother, Sharon, and grandfather, Mr. O.D. McKee, look on. Photo taken in 1963. Very cool tradition. Now let's eat some of that tradition now. All right. I mean, let's eat some of their food, not the tradition. You know what I'm trying to say. Here we go. Never, never had these before. I just dumped them all out. Let me just lay them down. Look at that. So that is the pumpkin spice. Nice. And most all, the face looks really good. Let me switch my camera angle for you. Alright, so pumpkin spice. I spice, not smice. I really smell it. Now he's got a wider, more pressed down pumpkin smile. He's got a thinner smile. I had to hiccup there for a second. Let me grab one of these guys here. I think I just like the look of him. I like that, you know, it looks like he's got lots of brains. Pumpkin with brains. <laughs> Ooh, look at that. So it's more like a, I guess it's a cookie. I wonder if it's like a pumpkin cookie? Let's see. And how do they fold that in there with the faces? That's cool. Let's see if we can, oop, I tried to open his mouth. I broke his lip. Ah, I think I'm learning. 
Yep, it looks like it's all the way in. So it is layers. It smells good. Pumpkin, not my favorite thing. I don't know why. And it's very moist. See how I can smoosh that back together? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. I could probably eat these with a cup of coffee. What I like about them is I get less spice and more pumpkin flavor. Hmm. It's good. It reminds me of that. Very tasty. But I've eaten too much now in this video. Let me bring them all back in and we'll just wrap it up. All right, so brought all three back in. And uh, what is my favorite? Hmm, that's really tough now. But I think I'm going to have to say I like the Pumpkin Delights. Why? Because it's just different. You know, I've had plenty of brownies. This is something that isn't overpowering to me. And look how happy he looks. See how happy he looks? So overall, I'm going to say really cool. Little Debbie always seems to hit the mark for me on thematizing their products and making sure that things, you know, are different, which is neat. So let me know in the comments then which you think you would like, which you've had, which is already your favorite. And then I uh, hope you're enjoying this Halloween series. It's been pretty exciting. Got some cool stuff still on the way. And as always, we'll have links for you in the description to other playlists and videos. Or you can always just go to our channel. And you do that by clicking on a name. You'll see LuckyPennyShop.com. Anywhere I comment or anywhere there's a clickable LuckyPennyShop.com. And that takes you to our channel. And then you'll see a row of tabs, the About Us and all that. But there'll be a little icon there, like a little looking glass. You can just click that and search anything you want. And you'll find all kinds of stuff. And thanks for watching. Later. If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh yeah, please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up. Thanks for watching.